Migration has a long history in Africa, including the slave trade and movements of colonial labor. Today, African migration is mostly within the continent and is expected to increase. People move in search of work and a better life, or to escape war, poverty, bad governance, and environmental degradation. Most migrants stay in Africa, but some risk their lives crossing the Mediterranean to Europe. But for many, migration has a happier ending. The safe and free movement of people and effective governance of migration is key to unlocking Africa's economic potential. Migrants bring their skills and labor. They can boost economies and they can send money home. Since 2008, remittances by migrants have been greater than foreign direct investment and international aid, as the largest source of foreign exchange earnings for sub-Saharan African countries. But the continent's leaders need the political will to implement Africa's many legal frameworks and policies on migration. The emphasis needs to be on the benefits of people moving freely across borders. There is a need to tackle xenophobia, human trafficking, and the limited resources of host countries. This requires a more coherent pan-African position on migration. In January 2018, an African Union summit adopted a new protocol on freedom of movement and the right of residence. It builds on the 1991 OAU Treaty establishing the African Economic Community. This could be what's needed to enhance regional integration and development. The next step is for Africa to streamline and consolidate its policies. This will be helped by positive messages on the benefits of migration. The ISS is grateful to the Hans Seidel Foundation for funding our migration research.